Hey everyone, Rarity Dash here, time for another blind commentary. And today I'm reacting to what has been a really highly requested video the past couple weeks, uh, the top 10 reactors list from WatchPony.com. Uh, people keep telling me about this and I've actually been kind of hesitant to even look at any of my comments on anything because of this, because I knew this was out and people were telling me about it, because I didn't want to spoil it for myself. I didn't want to know where I placed on the list if I did. I assume I did because, I mean, so many people are telling me about it and uh, that would probably be why, though uh, I don't know for sure. Regardless, this should be a fun video to do. It's been a while since I've reacted to a WatchPony.com uh, top 10 list. Uh, it was a real staple of my channel for a little while there with uh, when I had the copyright strike because all the videos are under 15 minutes. It was an easy thing to just do uh, during the week, but uh, I don't think I've really done one since I got my channel back to full standing, and uh, yeah, it's it's really about time I changed that because these are these are really well made and just pretty fun. Uh, top ten reactors is an interesting subject, as well as making reaction videos. I watch a lot of them, and uh, I don't know who my top ten would be. Uh, uh, Blank check probably deserves the top spot because of all the work he puts into his videos. Uh, definitely. Definitely would give him the number one, but other than that, I'm not really sure. Uh, lots of people I could name. Luffy, Flaming Shark, uh, people like Brony Burning Axe, Zeb. Uh, yeah, there are just a lot of great reactors in the community, and um, I'm sure this will be a great list. Um, anyway, let's go ahead and get started. Okay. And here we go. Word before this top ten. Reactors all the time are being harassed and are being taken down and, and we got Alex side off of making their videos on the other side of the spectrum oh. Reaction videos are stealing Jack potential T. Herbert views and TV rating from oh, the just touching on the controversy here I guess long hours on making their projects a reality yeah, it's definitely a two-sided so argument please, as us viewers please support both the original video and the react indeed they both need the views so they could continue their craft. Pie dislikers. Please, you must support both. Thank you. Watchpony.com Now here we are going to be reacting to My Little Pony, Friends of His Magic, Season 6, Episode 21. Never I seen this guy before. What's better than watching ponies alone? Let's watch ponies together. You're about to watch Bunny. There I am. <laughs> We're getting down our picks for the top 10 Brony Reactors. Hi, everybody, and welcome to an exciting react. For this list, we're looking at the YouTube channels that react to My Little Pony episodes and Brony projects. If they react to other shows and videos, that's all right, too. As long as they're still Bronies themselves and have reactions. I guess you gotta include Rationus, even though he doesn't do much pony months. stuff anymore. This includes commentators, base cam reactors, and fans that just love to watch. However, we're excluding Let's Players since that is a list for another and, day. Yeah. Oh my goodness! <laughs> if you feel and Vanna does it in character, so. Should be on the list. Be sure to check out our similar list of the top 10 reactors does... from Bronies React. Oh, that's actually oh so scary. we're not including Bronies React? 10. Luffy is cool. Luffy is cool. Kicking off our list is the UK Brony with the exact same beanie and practically every <laughs> reaction. Yeah. Well, I think I the mean, posh transatlantic accent starts sounding British, so it oh, might not be. Using the standard face cam setup, he gives clever comments. Very and entertaining a man. Bit snarky at moments. He's got a cheery attitude and sees great moments. He points out a lot of great points in episodes, gives a lot of hilarious faces and expressions. And though he rarely reacts to fan made projects, his episode reacts does some, are really uh, good. Never change. A bridge series man. stuff. Uh, UFP, scooter tricks. Back and forth, they did. That was incredible, and that's where the five came from. Number nine, a question well, yeah. reflection. Not a channel I've this watched much recently. Have fun together watching episodes I don't know of MLP. Do they do as much content anymore? Six or so, Equestria's Reflection is a group of reactors that consist of Cash Kestoff, Wolf San Hiron, Gem, Xenofire, Voltron We the Scholar, Atomic Baby One, Lots two, of people. and Leroy. This group does a wide-angle camera react that captures everyone at the same time and captures all the fun. Where are you? <laughs> the reactions can get a bit 
chaotic at times. And Discord's on screen when I say that, I realize. <laughs> Number eight. Good one. Mr. Cobalt Sky. Oh, come on. You're not allowed to do that. Kobaltsky. Yeah. As rude as that was, thank you, Pinkie Pie. A great reactor for episodes, Mr. Cobalt Sky is a commentator style reactor with a very soothing sky background. He's also got an awesome voice and mic quality. While his commentary is rather generic, he gives great reactions and gets surprised quite often. Thank you, Rarity. Aww. Okay, it's time to open your <laughs> to me. Just throws Rarity to the ground. He mostly reacts to full episodes and mentally advanced series, but in both cases, he got all the laughs. Did a stallion just make a flare joke? Did they just go there? <laughs> Number seven, Epic V. You may know He's this good. reactor if you know Blank Chat, <laughs> but we'll get to him later. Epic V or V is a funny and great. Reactor. I should watch her more. She's an enjoyable person, has a great sense of humor, and gives great reviews. More I've seen has been good though. Her reactions in Vector Animatic style, which I really nice admire. I like this little song. Oh, it's it's it's. I forget her name. <laughs> Don't tell her. <laughs> she also does gaming. I think I forgot too when I watched squad, that video. Like check and double play. Might have My even God, said the wrong name. Beautiful. That was absolutely amazing. I really like that. Number six, oh. Jack T. Herbert. He doesn't but make reaction videos anymore, so. Why? Okay. He was great though. Living it up in the Probably UK the first one, one I ever watched. Expressions on this list. Jack has been in the reacting game and in the Brony fandom for a long time, and has even branched out into other fandoms by doing live streams and gaming. He's got plenty of laughs, purely because this guy is so easy to discuss. His most hilarious videos are his reactions to the inappropriate Brony projects and tumblers. Even random videos are enough to get him into his crazy face. But after what he's been through, I could see why he stopped reacting to ponies. Number five, Brony Monster 44. One of the most popular reactions. Don't actually watch him of, much. Brony Monster 44 is in charge of a Brony React and a Brony Couples React, where they react to the latest episode and react to famous Brony projects. That would probably be me if so I tried. Cute it idea, out. I have to admit. Thank you. Like, you oh be, you, my gosh, like, I know what we're doing next time I see you. Oh god. <laughs> it's fun with both. The commentary and chemistry on Brony Couple React is charming, and the camera reaction from Brony React is hilarious. It was magical! <laughs> well, it has, you know, MLP related stuff in it, so. Number four. Only four for Ratchet. Ratchet. I guess because he guys, Ratchet, doesn't here. do much funny anymore. One of the fan favorites from AC Ray's Best Bronies React series, Ratchetness is hilarious, entertaining, and just awesome to watch. He's got a lot of jokes and just a hilarious laugh, too. His channel is great. And yeah, he is pretty good. Popularity with over 200,000 subscribers to this day. Even successfully branched off to other shows like oh, Ruby. He's got Ruby reactions. Plays. When he reacts, I gotta he watch also those. Gives a descriptive wrap up in the end as well. Ratchetness never changed, man. But again, and again, and again, keep fighting. Number three, Alex Sai. One yeah, of the most popular I guess. camera side reactors, and have been reacting to pony projects for a long time. We can't really he kind of made me angry with his rarity investigates loved watching reaction, and but <laughs> that's just me. <laughs> <laughs> no! Recently taking a break and even making a few life changes at the moment, Alex has always been battling to bring us great content even at the expense of his YouTube standings. Watching him react to videos we love and inviting others to join along too. Okay, okay, I shut up. Let's do this. <laughs> number two, Blank two? Slate. Oh, one of the most well-known. Am I number one? <laughs> wow. And overall, or am I just a honorable mention? Blank Check has reacted to that would make all sense. the most popular brony videos in this fandom. On top of all that, he also plays games like My Little Karaoke. Oh! Oh, what is this? 
Who is this beautiful person? <laughs> Go back to him. Yeah. He's a funny guy and gives great inputs, and even gets shipped with Epic V. He's loyal and very active with ponies and the brony fandom, uploading at a rate of at least two videos yeah, a week. This stuff's great. But with such an awesome fan base that keeps him up to date with what to react, it's a no-brainer. Well, honorable mention. <laughs> I'm really glad to get that much at least. Number one, Rarity oh. Dash. Okay. <laughs> one of if not the <laughs> Fake most me out there. channel on this list, uploading at a rate of nearly one video a day. Well, Rarity not anymore, Dash but. It all. Blind reactions, analysis videos, episode reviews, and brony reactions. Even reactions to Ruby, Steven Universe, and even reactions to Generation 1, My Little Pony. That's wow, fun. Talkative. I need to do more G1. Reacting to videos that don't call for reactions, like 107 Facts series or brony analysis videos. Just remember, he loves to ship. <laughs> do you agree with our list? Yeah, I don't know. Yeah. I, I see. I get it. I understand. I comprehend. Which I'm glad Luffy. Is your favorite? Oh, time to go. Posted every week. Be sure to subscribe and check out WatchBunny.com for more. Thank you for watching, and you may now look away. Also, Pegasus doesn't taste that bad. <laughs> <laughs> that looks like an amusing guy. Okay. Well, <laughs> I don't know how to feel about that. I mean, uh, yeah, um, Blank Check definitely works a lot harder on his videos, uh, and yeah, most of those people, they're probably better than me, but I guess, I guess if you react to Watch Pony's videos, you get them on your side, uh, <laughs> I don't know. Uh, well, I guess my volume doesn't hurt, though it's uh, my, my rate isn't quite the one video a day that it used to be. Well, I mean, I was going two videos a day at one point, so maybe it's sort of evening out now. Uh, and yeah, the reviews and stuff, that doesn't hurt me. I guess I can see the argument, but uh, I certainly wouldn't rate myself that high. <laughs> A nice fake out was using my honorable mention clip there. I I, I did think there that I was <laughs> gonna be an honorable mention, but there weren't any honorable honorable mentions. Uh, well, I guess we can just take the other reactors that they showed, like Atomic Catacombs and uh, all those people, as the sort of honorable mentions that could have been included but weren't. Uh, and uh, yeah, it was it was a pretty good list, I, I would say. I mean, uh, as said, Jack T. Herbert. Not sure I'd include him since he's not really making new reaction content at the time anymore. Uh, though by the same, on the on the on the other hand, uh, yeah, he was probably the first reactor I ever watched, and a lot of the reason that I decided to ultimately get into reaction videos and start watching more of them, so he definitely is a big part of the reactor world, I guess. And uh, I would have said Ratchet is probably, uh, if you're going to include him, he'd be number one, but uh, I guess number four because he doesn't produce too much MLP content anymore. Uh, so yeah, that's probably fair. And uh, I definitely do need to find his Ruby videos now. <laughs> Didn't know about that. Uh, and, uh, yeah, blank check. Uh, I would have put him number one, but that was the finest place for him, if, if not number two, I guess. I, uh, and, uh, yeah, most of the other ones, pretty good. Uh, don't have too much more to say. Thank you, WatchPony.com, for including me in this. It's really flattering and <laughs> it does leave me feeling kind of weird but uh i really appreciate it hope you like the commentary if you did and see you in the next one